Hello love bugs, it's me Loverly. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are back again with our Sims 4 Seasons family, the Poncho family. They're here on their little farm. So today is a Monday in game and it's just been the start of spring. So finally all the snow has melted and yeah the farm is getting back to, into the swing of things. Mom here was planting. Oh no, but she's cold. Uh oh, okay. Dang it. Can you finish planting that though, please? Just plant all. I wish I could say plant all. I don't think I can. Hopefully she's gonna be okay. I am a little scared, but we really want these to all grow at the same time, so. Oh good. Dad, maybe you could help plant these as well then. Just just plant all those first. Anyway, we finally are planting our very first flowers because it is the start of spring and I said once we get into spring we will actually start planting flowers so that is why that's what we're doing here <laughs> it takes so long though I wish you could say plant all it's like they improved the gardening a little bit but there's definitely still some things that would have been great to have just like the plant all option or the I don't know maybe it's maybe it does come at a higher rank we'll see but anyway, okay, good. So that is all being planted. Oh, oh, well, we'll have to move that. Um, okay, they're both exhausted. You know, why don't you guys go to sleep then? Go to sleep. Mom, you can go to sleep too, cause she's she's like really tired uh, and cold. <laughs> but anyway, um, basically, we're back here. We had this tree set up in here just because when it's climate controlled like this, apparently it's harvestable all seasons, which is kind of cool. So that's why eventually we want to move away from having these open fields and do more something like a, what would you call that? A, um, a greenhouse. A green, we want, we want to eventually maybe build out a greenhouse. My, Probably still have all the orchards like we'll probably convert all of this land into orchards and then figure out a way to have some sort of greenhouse area for everything else that isn't going to be orchards like mostly flowers and things maybe. Anyway, oh yeah, our kitty. Look you guys. So we got our little kitten last time. Little puddles. So cute. Wow, I can't even get very close to puddles. Hold on. There you go. Real potters. So cute. <laughs> anyway. Um, so yeah. Also, for those of you guys who didn't know, I did just do my very first Twitch stream. So, and it happened to be my birthday stream. And I ended up going, I only planned to go like 5 hours. But I was having so much fun. I decided to do 12 hours. So, that was so much fun. Thank you guys. Anyone who came by, stopped by, wished me a happy birthday. And congrats on first time streaming and all that thank you so much you guys really did make my day like so so much so yeah appreciate all of you guys who did that for me thank you and um yeah so now i'm uh if you happen to not catch that um i might make a highlights reel of it just for fun because i did record a majority of it um there was part of the night where it's just like the there was severe lag spikes so uh, it didn't actually, like, have a continuous 12-hour stream, but, like, I mean, yeah, it was just popping in and out. So, anyway, I I did cut out some of that. Like, I couldn't record all 12 hours, but I definitely got a majority of the night, and so I'm going to go back through and, like, kind of just do a highlights reel. <laughs> uh, and so, yeah, I'll probably upload that to my YouTube channel as well. So look forward to that if you are curious of what happened because I don't have any VODs right now because I'm not uh, technically an affiliate. I think affiliates get VODs, I'm pretty sure, but I'm working definitely towards it. I got real close to my goal of 50 followers. We're at 41 last I checked on Twitter followers, so that's awesome. Again, if you uh, are interested in ever watching me go live, Definitely go over, jump over to my Twitter. It's the same as here on YouTube. It's Loverly, L-O-V-E-R-R-L-E-E. -E -E. <laughs> so, yeah, 
two R's, two E's is what I like to say, but technically there's three E's, so it doesn't make much... You guys get it. <laughs> anyway, just don't forget that second R. A lot of people forget that second R. Uh, anyway, yeah, so j jump over there and follow me if you want to find out when I'm going live. Um, right now, I'm planning on just going live... I would want to say, like, every Friday. I'm going to aim for every Friday. But that could change. So, you know, it's always just good to follow me, have that notification on, and then you can find out when I'm going live. But, yeah, anyway, <laughs> that's my little plug for my my Twitter channel. But, yeah. Um, but it was a lot of fun. We actually, so, we actually ended up playing Sims 3, too. So, if you're interested in Sims 3 play content, most likely we're going to be doing Sims 3 um, most days. Although next week, this Friday, I might do Minecraft. Oh, come on. You're so close to finishing. No, I know. And Oh, gosh. Really? You can't continue watering because she's so uncomfortable to pee. Okay, fine. Should we make, like, a little outhouse over here? I feel like this... I feel like they would totally have an outhouse, right? Maybe an outhouse wouldn't be a bad idea. That way they don't have to walk all the way back into the house because it's a big lot, you know? Um, I might just do that because I, I thought, like, an outhouse would be funny looking. Of course, the problem is I really hate how you can either, on the lot, you can either have a foundation on everything you build on the lot or not. And that's very unrealistic, especially for a farm. Because from what I imagine an outhouse, it has stairs up to it. It has, like, it's on foundation, it has stairs, and it's just, like, this tiny room. And it's not going to look right. But if I put everything else on foundation, it, you know, the barn is obviously not on foundation. And uh, the house I would have liked to have on foundation, but this, like, this little building, I don't even know what to call this, the shed. The shed wouldn't be on foundation. So it's just really frustrating that there's, like, it's either or, like, there's no... There's no variety there. I really hope that's one thing that the Sims team... They've been really responsive, luckily. Uh, I think more than ever. The Sims team, the Sims 4 team, I should say. Thanks to the internet and their involvement in Twitter. Like, they don't really actually have to be involved in Twitter at all. But they're just voluntarily very responsive. And have given back... You know, have given the community what they want in a lot of ways. So I'm hopeful... I'm very hopeful that they will eventually make that an option as well because I would love, 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 love to actually officially make, like, just make this the way I want it. In fact, that's why I built, like, I changed the design of this house just so it looked good without foundation, but ideally I was going to make it with foundation and it would have probably turned out looking differently. So, but I had to make that decision of, like, oh, okay, either build with foundation or not, but I've never seen a barn on foundation, so. Anyway, that's my spiel. I'm sorry, like, I'm sure you, some of you guys out there are like, whatever, it doesn't matter, who cares? But I'm just, like, a stickler about that stuff. Also, I really want, speaking of outhouses, where is a door with a little moon on it? That's what I want. I want a moon door. You guys know what I'm talking about, the little cutout of the door, the moon. Hmm... Would this look like an outhouse door, potentially? Kind of, yeah. And see, also, and then, <laughs> if they fix that foundation thing, then also the, the wall heights. Because if I do that, it, I, I mean, I'm not going to do it because it's going to screw up everything. Oh, I just did. Oh, gosh. See, but it affects everything on this plane. So it can, yeah. So rooms really should be allowed to change wall heights and foundations and all that separately because yeah see it just like totally affected my barn and my house so can't do that I had to undo it but yeah you guys get the idea right so those kind of options hopefully before the sims 4 is done it would be amazing if the sims team could figure out how to fix that because it would just give us so many more build options all right anyway i said i'd stop I always do that. I said I'd, I'd stop rambling and I'd continue for like another 12 hours. Okay. Oh, it's nighttime right now, so I, let me let me see what it would look like during day. Yeah, there we go. That's kind of outhousey. I don't know what kind of, what kind of roofs do outhouses have? I'm just going to assume like one of these really basic roofs like that, right? Oh, gosh. 
<laughs> it's got Christmas tree lights. Oh, that's too funny. That's too good. Who would put Christmas tree lights on their outhouse? <laughs> uh, see, cause, see what I mean? It's like way too tall now, but it makes sense that this is tall. Mm. Why can't, this is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> why can't I just have what I want? All the time, forever, without any question. No. <laughs> okay. See, because the, the it's like you can at least have different roofs per section, so it's not like it's. I don't know. I feel like it's it's not impossible. They just haven't figured out how to do it yet. Okay. Let's do this. No, this one. Okay. Hmm. I still don't like that I can see underneath it. Like, I wish. Uh, slightly better. I don't know. Like, there's some weird weirdness happening here. Maybe it's because I did that. Does that look better? I mean, I guess technically. It just doesn't look like an outhouse, right? It doesn't look like. Maybe outhouses don't have this. Maybe I'm thinking something else. Maybe I need like some roof decoration top thing. Like I feel like they have like one of these, right? Like just a little stack of some kind of smoke stacky thing out of it. Why am I thinking that? I don't know. Where am I getting that from? Well, I like this. It's just unfortunately it's all it's all brick, right? Yeah. There's not even a stone one. I mean, there's that's technically stone-ish. Okay, those are stone. Okay, stone could work. I just don't want brick. Stone, we, we have a lot of stone elsewhere. Which one matches? It's like that right there on, um, on the house, this stuff. I want it to match that, but I, I think that's the one that's supposed to match. It doesn't quite match. It's frustrating, but I think that's the one that's supposed to. Um... Oh, or we have this. Oh, hold on. Does that look, that looks better, doesn't it? Or I could shrink that other one that I just had. Hold on. Make that. Just make them have two there, maybe? I don't know. Oh, ew. I kind of like the dirty stone. I don't know. <laughs> it kind of makes sense that it would be like. I like this one. Hmm. Okay, that's gonna be <laughs> good enough. And then let's do some just real quick roof trim because I'm not trying to turn this into some build stream. I just wanted, I just thought this would be easy. So let me, it's easy enough to just build real fast a little outhouse so that they wouldn't have to walk so far. Um, hmm. What kind of... Just like that. Yeah, like that, there we go. See, so it's kind of like, just wood up to that certain point, and then what would it be up here? What do I have up here? Oh, you know what? I don't think it shows, so. Hmm. Let's just do the, the household, like, wood, right? Because, I mean, we're imagining he's building this. Yeah, there we go. Out of, like, just straight up pieces of plywood and stuff. <gasps> Should these be switched? Maybe. Oh, you know what's annoying, too, though? Hmm. Actually, I liked it better like that. Should I have two of these? I don't know. I'm. <laughs> that makes no sense. I don't know. There's definitely better ways to make it. Oh, yeah. And then I was going to do the classic. Let's see. I'm going to get the decal on there. Here we go. <laughs> You know, classic decal. Perfect. <laughs> and, uh, oh yeah, this is in the inside as well. Um, would it just be dirt floor? 
Yeah. Let's just say dirt floor. Uh, which is where? Oh. I know there's a floor that's supposed to look like dirt. Here it is. Bottom of a basement. <laughs> Perfect. There you go. There's our little outhouse, except I need a... Oh, man. You know what? I'm 99% sure there's a way he can... He can actually make his own. Now that's annoying though. Is there like... Sorry you guys, I keep saying, oh, this is, it's not a build stream, but then keep thinking of little details to add. Is there... Oh man, that's crazy. Uh... Yeah, I just need something that's not gonna... Is that like the most basic? I need one that's really basic. Oh, I mean, I guess that other one matched. Oh, here we go. Which one? Mm -hmm. That one does match the best, I think. Yeah. There we go. Our little weird outhouse. And, um, and he's supposed to be able to, like, craft. Oh, craft furniture. Here we go. Wall shelf, hanging mirror, garden pot, garden planter, end table, bar stool. Dang it. We still don't have enough. Ooh, but we can do all these other sculptures. Aw, he can make a sad sculpture. Why don't you do it, Dad? Oh, kitty. Why are you sleeping there, Puddles? We bought you a bed right by the nice fireplace. <laughs> Aw, are you going to... Oh, she's going to water. Okay, that's cool. Thanks for helping out. I do love that the girls are older now that they can start helping out. It's pretty awesome. All right. Here he is. He's gonna build this. Alright, let's just fast forward through this. How are they taking care of their needs? School's gonna start in an hour? Okay. So we could either, there's a couple things we could do, you guys. We could go to school with them. Quote unquote school. I think we'll do that after, actually, the after they actually get back from school. Quote unquote. Um, because I don't actually have the get to school mod installed right now. I just, that's something I really wish came with get to work too. Who am I? Pick something you like. Yep. Whatever. <laughs> Check out your Sims inventory. Okay. Uh, hold on. Dad, can you continue scrap, uh, less? Crafting some sculptures, please. These look good. I want these in our house. <laughs> large bear sculpture and a large lumberjack sculpture. Those sound amazing. So yeah, right now we're just going to leave the outhouse empty because I'm 99% sure he could build a... He actually can build a, um, a toilet eventually. And even a bathtub. Um from what I've overheard. Okay, so mom, I know your energy is low, but like, did you do this? Pristine and dry. <gasps> yes. Okay, so load this back. This is, um, looks good. Oh man, I think we just find, we planted all of these. Dang it. All right, well at least they're, um, they're gonna grow. So we can start adding whatever this plan is. I forget what it is. We definitely need more um, flowers, though. We're gonna, we're gonna need like I don't even know how many flowers are in the game, but it would be great to know so that way we can like actually get like all the different kinds of trees, all the different kinds of flowers, and then not all vegetables, but certainly a a good selection of you know, let's say, uh, harvest like I don't know what what kind of, let's just say like standard vegetables, you know, like, oh, cabbage, carrots, potatoes, onions, because we already have all the onions. I think those are mushrooms we already have. So we've got mushrooms and um, onions right now. I think we should just uh, continue to do stuff like, because, like, we've got a lot. Like, we're going to have to cut down this mushroom patch about by half. We're going to get rid of half of these. Onions have been good to us because they're both they're they're multiple season so we're gonna maybe keep all those but it would be great to have like i don't know another patch like this size patch of carrots this size patch of uh you know lettuce or potatoes we're gonna need to figure out we're, we're I'll, I'll i'll do that i'll figure that out and then this is the 
we're gonna have to just cut down our groves here because there's still not enough room this is like the biggest lot on the in the game and i'm still like there's just not enough room to have like a proper like farm but then again it's like most farms stick to like one thing honestly school project students are allowed to choose their own assignment for an upcoming school project. Should Maple choose an easy assignment and ensure a good grade or find a more challenging assignment and learn something new? Easy assignment, tough assignment. Mm. So try to try to challenge yourself, I guess. Okay, dad is done with that. Let's continue a sculpture. Uh, let's do a elephant sculpture. We're just trying to get his skill up. I don't know. Let's see. Let's, what's, what is his skill? Okay, he's not even halfway to maxing it out. So it might take a while to actually get that handmade toilet that we want. But it'll be so worth it, you guys. Believe me. And, like, there's a, I know there's a tub, too. And I don't know what we would where we would put a tub. Uh-oh. Ew. It's so dirty and gross in here. Yuck. This poor kitty. Hey, kitty. Sick him. Kitty. You're supposed to get the rat. <laughs> oh my god, this poor kitty though. She's like, oh my god, they're almost as big as I am. It's terrifying. Oi, oi, oi. Oh gosh, wait. Kitty. Kitty, be careful. Kitty, be careful. <laughs> um, oh gosh. I'm trying to get like a picture of like all three of them out at the same time with the kitty nearby, but that's probably not gonna happen. <laughs> um, oh, uh oh, mom's like scared about the rats. Yeah, well, you, oh yeah, kitty wants food. Give 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 Puddle some food, and then let's clean up all this mess. Like, ugh, what is happening in here? Ugh, yuck, yucky. Okay, so just. Yeah, there you go. Feed the kitty. Now that we actually have some money, which is great. Although, did we get bills in the last part and I just didn't pay them? Yeah. We can just afford our bills. So let's pay those bills as well. And then mom can clean the litter box as well. Okay, dad, how is that going? Oh, no, I know you want to do that, but... Oh, gosh, dang it. Okay, he is uncomfortable, so he can't do that anymore. Oh, well, at least we got three sculptures out of him. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a horse sculpture nice very nice so i love this setup but it's very seasonal so we're gonna take it and put it in our family inventory we don't have a lot in there right now anyway so we're just gonna put away our holiday decorations actually well the only problem is like i was again going for realism here it'd be great to like actually store it up here with everything else but these lights stay on forever so it's kind of like lame so we'll put but we'll put that up there but it's it's annoying you can't just turn on and off your off your candles like a real light i don't i don't think hold on <laughs> now i'm like wait can you no it would be cool oh, oh yeah you can turn off this light oh man what am i saying i did okay you totally can yay perfect so um i apologize i apologize Sorry, I did not. Oops. Sorry, I didn't uh, believe in you this time. Okay, there we go. Perfect. So now we have unlit candles up in the storage balcony. Or balcony. <laughs> this. I think I'm just going to get rid of this because it's unrealistic. I don't know if we. I feel like we lost a lot of money on that purchase, but. Again, I'm going for super realism here. They are from a different time period where electronics is not really a thing. Uh, clean out the spoil too. Although they have a lot of property taxes, my goodness. Um, are we playing? Hold on, what's happening? Oh, there you are. <laughs> I just love seeing the little rats here. Like, I think it's funny. And the kitty is perfect because I didn't even realize kitty is a prowler. So the kitty is like, look, she's like starting to get the courage up to like confront these guys. Really works with my story here. <laughs> it's like, hey, stay out of my territory. Okay, 
Um, good. So we paid the bill. So now we only have a, a hundred thirty-seven simoleons. Super sad. But you know, we've got some things to harvest as well. Dad is just taking a nap. You know, mom's doing all the heavy lifting today, huh? I take care of the kitty litter and the icky food in the fridge. There you go. Okay. Um, why don't you also, can you harvest? No, nah, she's in too much of a icky moody too. Wait, do you have any, um, leftovers? Yeah. Just why don't you eat something then? So I thought it would be cool now that the girls are grown up to also start joining, um, scouts. However, we just spent all of our money. <laughs> Uh, so I don't even know how much it costs to join Scouts, but I, like I've said before, I actually, before Seasons came out, before I heard any sort of rumors about what was going to be in the pack at all, I didn't know there was going to be Scouts introduced, which is so awesome, but it was so cool because I had already built a Scouts thing, and that's something I definitely want to show off in this Let's Play as well. Maybe not today, but I did just go renovate it with all the new season stuff so look forward to seeing that soon in an episode either probably next part or the part after that depending you know best laid plans I always have like these grand ideas of, like what I'm gonna get to do and then it's just like especially since I'm only trying to do half an hour parts now it's pretty crazy how fast it goes I think oh yeah so I got all these Ah. <laughs> Yay! Actually, oh dang it, I sold parts. I probably should have kept them for actually upgrading, but that's okay. I haven't upgraded anything yet. But I do love that handiness and wood woodworking is the same skill at now. Like before, I was like, that's weird that it is. But at the same time, it's actually very helpful <laughs> right now. Uh, so let's put all these wooden sculptures above the fireplace because that's not dangerous <laughs> and then we'll put this thing look it's like all sad <gasps> oh. <laughs> yeah we'll just stick that on the table for now i don't know don't ask me why what oh i was like what is this it's a kitty <laughs> it's a kitty toy but it looks so much like our actual kitty right now <laughs> uh i was like wait Who's left the kitty? <gasps> no. That's awful. Okay. Eat that cake. Oh, you can't? Is it icky now? Did it just go bad? Oh, clean it up then. Are you no longer hungry? Yeah, he's fine. Uh, he just needs fun, and I don't know what's fun around here. <laughs> this is fun. This is... <laughs> Quick. If, while your while your wife and your daughters aren't looking, go swing on the swings, Mr. Manly Man. <laughs> He's like, I'm so tough and macho. But when my when my wife and daughters aren't looking, I'm gonna swing on the swings because it's the only thing that's fun around here. <laughs> it's weird that he doesn't have fun doing the woodworking because that's like a hobby uh, of people, but. Oh, we should really probably take down the Christmas lights. It's already spring. Uh, oops. All right. Well, Mom's up, and let's not have her notice. <laughs> Dad's on the swings over here. Not that it matters. I mean, I'm just teasing because, like, some people make that, like, important. I'm not trying to suggest that it is. I'm just, for his character, I feel like he's one of those guys who kind of kind of would feel that way, you know? But there's nothing wrong with a grown man swinging on some swings in his own backyard, you know what I mean? <laughs> swings are the best. <laughs> I've said that so many times since seasons. Like, it was literally the my favorite thing that they added to the game because they used to have it in all other... Well, not Sims 1, but Sims 2 and Sims 3. I definitely remember them having swing sets as well. And it's one, always one of my favorite objects. Okay, what were what were I doing? What were I doing? What was I doing? <laughs> I can speak. I can I can speak, I promise. Let's do our laundry. Uh oh, we were gonna have mom do something, but I don't remember. It's okay. <laughs> Aw, look how cute. Dad's being carefree. You know, sometimes. Oh, we were gonna take down those stupid Christmas lights. Okay. <laughs> 
Okay, Mom, go upstairs first. Do Christmas lights. That's why. Because I was like, I need to move this over. Because I got a little bin to store these two real... Two, two um, modern plastic kind of bin. Uh, take down. Just take down the decorations first. And then do laundry. Because you can't... Oh, she can search pockets first. Okay. Did did you search the pocket still? No. Search, search, search those pockets. We need every little dime we can get. Oh, girls are home and they're just standing around not knowing what to do with themselves. Okay. Well, go do your homework then. I don't know. Gosh. Ugh. Ugh. No, then take a nap. Gosh. You guys... Okay, they both are really tired. They need to figure out what to do for themselves, honestly. Alright. Mom's doing this never-ending laundry. See? Totally worth the 16 simoleons. Totally worth. Um, Alright. Although, I think... Did, did she take down the decorations? Yeah. Good. I like how that's not, like, a gigantic chore like it is in real life. <laughs> It's like it would take you the whole day to take down your decorations in real life. And then in this, it's just like they don't even bother animating it at all. But anyway, I think this is where we'll probably end it. We didn't get much done, um, sadly. But, you know, that's just how this goes. Like, you know, I feel like we're... I always feel like I'm never doing anything. Um, maybe we should just speed through the rest of the day. What is Dad doing? He's... Exhausted. He's gonna go to sleep. Yeah, fair enough. Go to sleep. Mom, do the laundry, please. I know you're exhausted, too, but... Mom's been the one working real hard today. But Dad did do a lot of sculptures, and, you know, we just have to keep getting that thing up. Um, here, let's give this little kitty... Oh, let's give this little kitty toy... Oh, you know, that's funny. The zero... Okay. I can raise it in... <laughs> so weird. So, um, if you guys... For those of you who don't know this, uh, pushing nine raises an object, and pushing zero lowers it. And I was testing out just now if I could do that in live mode. And the funny thing is I can raise an object using nine, but zero will pause the game. <laughs> That's a little funky, but anyway. All right, so yeah. Uh, again, I'm over time, but you know what's new. Oh, Dad didn't go potty before I went to sleep. Everyone's just exhausted, so we're gonna probably end this uh, after Mom gets this laundry done. But yeah, it's it's unfortunate that you know I I feel like I never get like a lot done per part, but that's just maybe me. Because I'm used to doing these long, like, hour parts at a time. And I know a lot of other people only do half an hour and are like, that's what a lot of people prefer to see. So that's what I'm going to try to stick to. Hi, kitty. Aww. Puddles. Yeah, today was just a nice uh, spring day. And we're going to, we're, we've got some goals coming up. We're going to work toward more, oh, mom just stopped doing stuff. We're going to work toward more, you know, obviously flower growing we've got this thing we still have to fiddle around with the making arrangements thing we've got woodworking to do oh gosh mom just keeps pausing that's concerning <sighs> all right i don't know what that's up about what is going off mom okay weird i don't know but anyway yeah so we've got to plant more flowers, more trees. Yeah, basically spring is a great time to start planting different crops and introducing new crops. Because last last year, quote unquote last year in this game, we, you know, they only had like three crops they were working on: apples and onions, and mushrooms. And now we're gonna we'll be we'll be expanding that a lot. So, pristine. Yes, go hang the pristine clothes on the dryer, please. Or, or clothesline, I mean. Uh, yeah, 
But I think this is where we're going to end it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this part. <laughs> uh, even though there wasn't much done, in my opinion, I hope you guys liked it. And until next time, I hope you guys have a lovely day. Thank you.